Good morning, guys and gals. I'm Pal, and it is another recording session. I am excited to play. It's been a long journey just to get to what I, I kind of consider to be the, the trailhead of us actually starting our journey away from Gerudo. This game has a, a particular... Whoa. Can we get to a sky island from here? As I talk about this game's particular particular skill set in in waylaying the path you want to take, but isn't that just how it, it becomes more exciting? We have a goal we want to achieve, and there are so many little hooks along the way that they're saying, "Hey, do this! Hey, do this!" And if you take them all, pretty soon you've long since forgotten that you are trying to go east. Welcome to the Gerudo Highlands, and the sky with the the ball, the sky ball, one might say, that I probably can't get to at the moment, but that's fine. I think we could probably go about this the same way that we went about Gerudo. We explore the highlands, and then we go down to the depths, and then we ascend to the heavens. I kind of like that model. There's nothing wrong with it. I think we keep going, going with that. Uh, let's see, where am I going? Where are we dropping, boys? Uh, let's go down a level. Yeah, I think I can just keep going straight forward. I guess I should probably pop my shoot. Unbearable cold. Okay, then let's fix that. I have learned, or at least I'm trying to learn. Does it work? Ha, <laughs> it works! Yes, okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be wasting some resources here on, from here on out, or I'm going to try to. This hopefully won't become like another uh, another photography debacle. Though to be fair, that isn't really my fault. I can't use that mirror. That's dumb. It's not my fault that that the camera removes or <laughs> takes pixels away from the the shot. I can't control that. Wow. Now I have a theory that I pro I probably can't see from here due to the draw distance. Okay, that's worth noting. I guess we we mark that. That's important. Edit. I kind of wish there were a few more pin options. These ones were great in Breath of the Wild when there were only f like, there were only ten things you can find, but now that there are so many other things, it's hard to classify everything. Uh, I'm almost above it. There it is. But I have a theory about uh, about Lynels and what has taken their place. I, I have a feeling that in the place of Lynels are are Gleox. I don't really have much uh, much proof for that statement, that hypothesis. But it I don't know. It feels possible. And I, I want to pay attention to that because this game definitely has a a, a sub theme. Of, of what once was in, Bre in Breath of the Wild. I wonder if we can ride moose. Oh, snap. Wait, it's running towards me. There was never any moose here. Let's go inside. A root for a bow. Let's... What is happening? What is this shrine? Um... Always look up. I guess we can fly. Hopefully. Yep. Not a problem. There's a ball, which we need the ball. I can ascend through that. Um. I'm curious. Can I? There's no way I can make that jump with. No, okay, okay. It was kind of close-ish, but not not super close. Okay, but I, I can ascend through this, and then I, I'm guessing I just use the ball to get the thing. Is it going to load me? Ah, yes, I always love that. It's so satisfying when you actually get the ascend, and it doesn't, uh, it doesn't invoke the loading screen, which is, it always kind of brings a little bit of a... A grimace from me <laughs> in editing because I'm like, oh man, it's like the easiest cut in the world, but you don't want to have to make the cut. It's just it's a little bit annoying. It, it messes with your groove, and then of course when we hit the loading screen, I yeah, I have to stop talking for a few moments because of it because I I mean 
It's not something I think you think about unless you do content creation, but you have to be mindful of loading screens. You also have to be mindful of very loud cars outside of your apartment. That's always, always fun. Oh! Can we ascend through the ball? Please tell me yes. We can! Nice! Nice! I love that. There's another ball! Uh, wait. Oh, I, I know what we need to do. I know what we need to do. It's something I should have done. There we go. It's something that I should have done in uh, the moment, which probably not all a lot of you saw. Actually, you know what? Did I even? I don't even. I didn't even pay attention to what I got in the chest. Like I actually do not. Oh, it was the it was the crystal. It was the charge. Probably not a lot of you saw because I did a a thing and didn't check the box to have you see the short, but. Uh, the moment from, what is it, two episodes ago, I want to say? Do we need to go up? No, that's where we got it. Oh, we need to do this. I don't know why I have this ball, but I'll find out. I guess I... Sure. <laughs> sure. Uh, I made I made the moment from a few episodes ago into a, a short, and I'm gonna try to uploading. I'm gonna try to upload shorts whenever I can. There are some moments that I can think of that were really exciting, and I'm sure there are some moments that you can think of that I can turn into into content. And it's something I've always wanted to do. It's something that uh, I guess my my role model channel Stephen Place has done is having these memorable moments. I just never got around to it. It'll be it'll be neat to finally do them. I don't need to do it under the guise of some sort of series. Oh, I was gonna get I was gonna get stamina between episodes. I guess it makes sense that I didn't because I can't warp, but You know what? Let's wait until I have two more. Ah. I said ah as though I consumed something in game, but I actually just consumed something in real life. I have a, a nice watermelon white claw at my side. Uh, am I? Oh. That's going to take a little bit of adjustment. H having a ruby on a shield is, is really nice. It's I, I'm curious if it's going to have any effect when I shield bash somebody. If it'll start, if it will like immolate them or whatever. It also is going to be weird because I'm, uh, I can't shield surf with this out. That's the one issue. Uh, I have this, I guess, so I can I can juggle these. It's not too big of a problem. Uh, you are a man. I don't really care about you as the man lizard that you are. Uh, you can continue to exist over there. Wild berries sounds like a something. Do I just kill you? Do you have ice breath? Oh, nice, Riju. Uh, you know what? I'm not gonna take that. I'm, I'm just gonna go... Blip. Killy. Ice Breath Lizalfos Horn, which I should probably be using a little bit more often. Do I have weapons that I can attach that to right now? I almost want to ditch... The Shock Emitter, or maybe I... The next time I can, I will ditch the Sapphire Rod. I... I'll try it out on something just to see what it's about. Because it... It's not going to freeze enemies, right? Although maybe it, because they're it's water, it'll work on them. It's definitely not going to work on this guy. It'll work on... this. My, the weapon I have right now will work on him. What am I doing? What am I after here? It, I don't think there's anything around. Some Blaseed Butterflies. Like, none of you will understand that reference. I, I get it. It is a reference, in fact, to myself. And I want to know, did they allow me... Mount, 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 mount. No! Why can't I mount moose? I just want to mount them. Why is that so forbidden? What do you have against me riding moose? What is that? Oh. Stupid moose. <sighs> Why didn't they let me ride him? You can ride deer. You can ride bears. Bears, come on. I forgot where I got this, but I do remember getting a hasty, a speed up three elixir, and man, if that isn't nice right now. 
Uh, I have a bow for this. Get ready. Get ready. Get ready. Later days, dudes. Get a muddle bud ready. Throw it at the archers. I barely snagged that. can't throw while I'm on the, the thing. That's disappointing. Ah. Whoa! That. Oh. Hmm. Huh. <laughs> Whoa. I hit the, the arrow. I hit the arrow with the puff shroom. Oh, my word. Let's throw some chaos in here. Uh, oh, and I have... I have weapons I kind of want to get rid of. Hey, buddy. Let's shock you. Throw another puff shroom. And while he's stunned, I am about to get hit. Oh, he hit him. He still doesn't see me. He still doesn't see me. He's dead. There's another one. Uh, he's not a concern on the, the platform, but I should keep him out of sight. I need to make sure I do not hit. There we go. His, his ice fruits. And you, sir. Just, just give up. I wish there was an option for them to just give up and, and put their hands up and surrender. That would be kind of cool. I'd be down with that. More games need to do that. That was a thing in um in Fallout 4 that I always thought was really cool. Like, the ability to, if you had a high enough charisma, you say, Hey, whoa, 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 whoa. Slow your roll there, bucko. And they're like, oh, you know what? You're right. You got the drop on me. That's it. It was, it was something that I, I kind of appreciated in, um I think it was the first. Wow, that's... Enables a powerful flurry rush during a perfect dodge. That's a cool... Ability. Do I drop this? You know what? I'm gonna drop this for it. That just sounds neat, and maybe I'll throw something on the end of it. That was something I appreciated in the first John Wick movie was was how if he got the drop on some of the the people, they were just like, you know what, John? I'm just gonna go home tonight. And he's he was cool with that. It's like, why why do they have to throw their life away? It just doesn't make sense. Um. What do I make of this? I mean, I could drop some fans. Maybe I drop some fans. I don't know if I use wing, although I could. I, I very well could, couldn't I? Um, they don't have any fans, but I do. I think. I don't have fans, are you kidding me? How do I not have fans? Well, that's lame. What's the point of this? I mean, the point of it is <laughs> is me having fans and, and being happy with my life. Uh, What is that? What is this? Is this a classic uh, Link's Awakening puzzle? What? What? They're all pointing at this tree. Right? They all are, right? I'm not nuts. Can I interact with those? I cannot interact with them. And they are indeed pointing at this specific tree. Am I supposed to cut it down? Also. I'm gonna cut it down. I think that's what they want. I'll use the boomerang, it's fine. That's... I'm certain this is a Korok Seed. I'm just not exactly sure how one gets it. And I'm not seeing anything. I mean, maybe I just cut down all the trees. I, There's no way that does anything other than waste the durability of my weapon and that yeah, this tree did nothing wrong. I think the only thing that this puzzle served to, served to do was waste the dur durability of my weapons and waste my my three star 
potion. So in other words, it was a waste of time. I will return to it though. I, like it's it's not nothing. It's just not something I understand. There's a you over there. I don't care about a you. There are you guys, which I really only serve to annoy me. And some wolves, which honestly, I'm kind of feeling. I'm 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 kind of feeling like I should start killing the wolves. Yeah, I, I hate killing wolves in video games. I really do. Uh, it just I think any any predator, but specifically any canine. I'm just I, ugh, man. But I I also have to tell myself I gotta eat, man. Oh, that's perfect. Why? Are you hostile? I mean, I'm hostile towards you. I'm I'm very hostile towards you. Oh, I hit a mushroom. Hey! Don't don't you run away from me? Don't you run away from me? I didn't say we were done. We're not done. You better not disappear. Don't disappear! Okay. My word, you have so much HP. Die! How much HP do you have? Don't disappear. I'm gonna spin on this guy. How much HP? There you go. You better drop us something absolutely amazing. Gourmet meat, prime meat, hearty salmon. Okay. Uh, wait. Whoa. Okay. That's not bad. I'm. I'm actually looking. I'm not looking for raw. Wait. I just hit my keyboard. Okay. I'm good. I'm not looking for prime meat. Actually, I'm. I'm looking for vanilla meat. For a reason. I'm not gonna say the reason until it happens, because it sounds ridiculous, and is hyping up something that might just be a certain person in my personal life throwing red herring at me, but I, I will show you when it happens. Also, this is like a fortress, I think, with enemies in it. This is like a legit fortress. Can I grab these? No. This is weird. Yeah, thank you, Zelda. I, I appreciate your doom and gloom. You know... You know, Zelda, maybe you should, like, reach out to me more. It seems like the only thing you have to say is that the world is ending, and I... I don't know, maybe we could, like, talk. If you can talk to me every time there's a full moon, maybe you could talk to me when there is nothing going on. Goodbye. Okay, good. I was going to say, if you didn't die from that, we were going to have words. Uh, man, a, a sturdy, long stick. Oh, my word. I'm going to fuse this to my this. For no reason. And I'm gonna ascend through this, because why not? Alright, that's the entrance. So it looks like we almost have to fight through this Samwise Gamgee style, which I'm down with. That's kind of cool. I'll deal with you in a second. <laughs> hey, everybody, how's it going? Can I have a flame emitter, please? Oh. Move, move, move. Those linger. Remember that they linger. Die. And then... Oh, man, the boomerang's good. I'm not just gonna use it willy-nilly. I'll just hit him with the fire. It looks like it does bonus damage anyway. Yeah, he, he burns a little bit. Do I have bombs? I actually don't know if I have bombs. Ooh, hold up, hold up. Two things. Bombs first off. I'm pretty sure I have them. 
Gerudo bow. I'm good. I'm I'm good. I'm good. I'm about to get another triple shot bow. But here's my question. Fuse. Okay, if I take the bow. Drop. Yep. Is the chest fusible to something? Thank you. Is it fusible? No, it's not. Okay, that's... F I, for I totally forgot I could fuse bows to things, which is, like, the most... It's really, like, the most pointless thing you could dream of. Uh, I have six bombs. Let's be careful about this. Uh, okay, not that careful. Maybe just a little bit less careful. Yeah, yeah, like, that level of careful. Okay, it looks like there's... There are two. I think... I don't know what the sapphire rod does. Oh, it is. It is icy. Okay. Yeah. Sup? There's a party now. Let's, uh... Let's not... Let's not use a bomb. Let's... That's, like, the opposite of what I want to do. Bombs? No. Uh, by fuse attack power, please. I would like to shoot them with... A... Gun? I'll... Sure, I'll shoot them with a tail. I honestly forgot, because so much time passed, that I assigned... I, I told Riju to do a thing. Uh, boosh! I canceled my last attack. I can't see his attack! Oh, thank you, Riju. Oh, you're still frozen. Really? You're still... You're still frozen. Um... Yeah, let's just, let's just do this. Let's just, uh, thank you for the shield. Uh, do you have another? Ow! I'm trying to disrespect you. It would be kind of you to understand that and allow me to disrespect you. Like that. Please die. You are dead, and honestly, I should stop trying to disrespect things that can one tap. Ice Breath Lizal Blade. Okay, it's made from a tree trunk, but like, I don't really have anything better. Also, it's a good example of what the Lizal weapons can do. Yes! Sign me up for that. Can I leave? Let's say easy. I guess I could just ascend out of here. Oh, I should probably grab his horn. And then we're immediately going to get into another combat, because... I'm surprised that took. Because I have a U. I have a U. 